Good morning. Yesterday was a little rough. I went to work and I didn't feel good at all. I just had this like lingering nausea. And today I'm eating. I just ate some toast, some applesauce, and there's a bucket sitting next to me. I think you know what all that means. So. I feel a lot better today than I did yesterday, but I don't want to be overly optimistic and push myself and then find out I'm actually not better, so I'm just chilling this morning before I have to go to work. We'll see if I I feel well enough to go to work. Later. So I'm going to try and go to work today. I feel a lot better. I've actually been able to eat like real food and just try and get things going again so I don't know hopefully this bug was just like a little 24 hour thing and it's all gone out of my system now but I'm not quite at a hundred percent but I'll I think I'll be fine I'll get through the day eventually it's Thursday and I'm feeling much better than I did on Monday, that's for sure. Um, so, today I have the day off of work. I don't have to go in and work at my regular job. So, today I'm going to get my taxes done. Woohoo! <laughs> Let's get the dust off of this. tree is still alive. Yeah, maybe we need to ask them how they keep their plants alive. Seeing as, you know, all of our plants end up dying. Oh, you're really close. Yeah, we're pretty good at killing plants. And our flower. At least our bamboo is living. We got the bamboo down. We got the bamboo down. I am trying so hard to keep this Venus flytrap from dying. But they're kind of hard. They're like, they're actually a really hard plant to keep alive. You're probably just looking up your nose right now. You realize that. Am I? They're just looking at my awesome beard. Yes. Well, they're looking at whatever you're pointing the at because they don't have a choice. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> you don't have a, well, I guess you could turn us off. But please don't do that. Oh yeah, that is just gorgeous. It just has blues and see pinks and oranges and like what is that peach it's like salmon swimming in the ocean i think that's like peach color too yeah oh and look there's like some dark purples over there ah yeah that's just that's awesome and it's not just like sky blue it's you like show them instead of talking about yeah, it look at this i mean oh, come on that's just amazing isn't it and look there's some like purple in that it's just like yeah. Sun's already dipped behind the horizon. Obviously, you're not getting that, but geez. Still, that is just absolutely beautiful. And you got the palm trees right there. I'm telling you, Arizona is the place to live. You dig dig your elbow into that. Ah. <sighs> My butt's sore. Ow. Are you recording this? <laughs> <laughs> Ow, ah, 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 ah. Okay, okay, hold on. I went skateboarding yesterday, and my left foot is the foot that stands on the board while I push with my right foot. And uh, I skated about two and a half miles yesterday. Now my butt's really sore because I basically did like two and a half miles worth of mini single leg squats every time I was on the board. Ah. Ooh. My butt. I have some thoughts. This week has been a little stressful. It's been a little rough because I started out the week being sick which I hate. I hate being sick. It's, 
it's so frustrating to be sick. And then after I got better, I just had a lot of stressful things happen in my life. Doing taxes is stressful. There's a lot of things in life that have been stressful lately. I don't know, when I get really stressed, what I do is I... I think about... how I'm trying so hard to do whatever it is that I'm trying to accomplish, whether it's... grow my personal training business, or... get a better job, or try to just be a better person and then I do these things and they just don't work out or it's just a lot harder than I thought or I'm not seeing progress in any of those things. Uh, throughout my life I've I've struggled with depression and I don't feel like that's unique or like, I'm the only person in the world that does, because I feel like everybody does at one point in their life or not, whether they acknowledge that it is actual depression or not. Like, people experience it, and I'm not trying to get your sympathy or sob story. I'm just telling you what I know. That's one thing that I, when I'm really depressed, is I, I do nothing. After I graduated from school and I got my license and was ready to get a job, but I couldn't find a job. It took me, let's see, I graduated in May of 2011 and I didn't get a job until February 2012. And so during that time, I had a lot of do nothing, do nothing isms, I guess. That's what you can call it. I would sit in the basement of Talon's parents' house and turn on a TV show I'd seen, you know, dozens of times, and just really literally do nothing like I didn't exercise I didn't want to cook I didn't want to do anything I just sat in that room and rotted away it's been probably one of the hardest times in my life that I can remember but you know it's it's okay I got through that and it wasn't easy and Talon was helpful even though he was very frustrated with me and I think very highly of him because of that time how he had to deal with me and how I was so ornery and unfun to be around but he still stuck with me and he still loves me I think the thing that keeps me from being depressed the most is really the opposite of you know, do nothing, you do everything. I think that's one of the reasons why I started to to vlog is because I wanted to do something and keep myself busy and keep me from doing nothing. And that's why I pick up so many different things in a way. I mean, I like to play the guitar, I play sports, I like to do all different kinds of exercise, biking and swimming and running and... I mean, I try to keep myself as busy as I can because that's what keeps me from getting depressed. So I guess when I stop posting videos, you can get worried because I guess that means I'm trying to do nothing. Or maybe it's really good because that means that I'm doing a lot of things. So I don't have time. I don't know. It's kind of an interesting paradox, don't you think? So, 
I think Haley and I have come to the realization that we just simply do not film enough. So we're kind of feeling that even if we're filming some mundane things or maybe some things that might not be as exciting, we think we need to do a little bit more quantity. Because, um, I mean, I, I know quality is always better than quantity, but we're trying to still put in like all quality work, but I think we need to put a little bit more quantity into it as well. And um, really, this is more for us than anything. And this is more like our journal than, than anything else, really. So I think we're going to start just filming a lot more of whatever we feelings. Can. Yeah, yeah. Like Kaylee said, our probably. Feelings. More of our feelings and just more things that we just do on a regular basis. So, um, I think it's just time to expect a little bit more footage. And I think we're going to try and start making two videos a week now. Haley wants to start doing a little bit more, uh, making everything a little bit more active so it is a little bit more entertaining. And, uh, I think I'm going to start making a little uh, segment of my own. Anton's um, gonna make his own video. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna try and, I'm still coming up with a name for it, but I already know what I'm gonna do, and I'll explain all that later on, so. Yes, you can look forward to that. So, here we go. Hands down. Don't tell me. <laughs>